Here's a really, really simple tutorial on some things that the crop tool can do that a lot of people don't really know about. Um, one is when you start to draw with a crop like this and it grays out your area, you can change the opacity of that grayed out area so that you can A, get have no idea what is outside there or have all of it show. By default it's at 75. A lot of people don't know that you can change that even though right up at here at the top it's available. Um, second thing is is when you go to crop something a lot of people will draw their crop box and then hit OK up here with the little check box. faster way to do that is just to draw the crop box and then double click inside it. When you double click inside the box that tells it you want to apply the crop and it'll happen. It saves a little time. Another thing you can do um, if you wanted to have a bigger document area, like say I wanted this guy twice and I need more area over here, a lot of people would do image, canvas size, pick the side anchor, add more width, and then hit OK, and then I get this more space over here. Quick way to do it if you don't need an exact amount is to just draw the crop box over your document, and you can click in the gray area and then just drag to fill the whole area. And then if you move your anchor outside the document to have more space, if you double click to approve that, it adds all that extra space. So like if I wanted more space below this, I could just drag the bar down below and then when I approve it, I get more space. Those are all things that a lot of people ignore with the crop tool, but they help speed up things. So hopefully that was helpful and hopefully